Hi YouTube, my name is Fishing and Hunting 1000. Today I'm going to show you some freshwater lures. The first one I'm going to bring out is my rooster tail. I have my rooster tail right here. Um, this is a, actually a very uh, great lure. And then I have my lipless crankbait. Two of them right here. Just get them unstuck. Anyways, this is all it is. Um, I have my other one right here. You can see the hooks are stuck there. There we go. You can get them up there at Bass Pro for three, four dollars on sale, and they work. Then I have this deep diver. And then I have one that I made. This uh, top water plug here. Um, I turned it out of the way and I just took a paintbrush and I flicked it at it. And that's how it made all these dots on top here. I'm gonna have just a little swivel with a 50 pound red leader. And then I have a bug bait. I have these bug baits right here. I use this in the winter. This just shows how good these things are. I use this in the winter and I got a hit off of it. And I reeled that bass in. It was a three pounder. It was about, uh, I'd say about 18 inches. It was a fat one too. But um, that's all for my freshwater fishing. Let's move on to my saltwater. My first saltwater lure that I'm going to show you is a terror rod. Um, all it is is just a white swimming body. This isn't mine. It's my cousin's. He left it over here on accident. Um, I haven't. He used it. He got some hits off uh, for some redfish down there. And, um, and some lagoons and all that. And then I have a spoon. All you do is you hook it up to a clip and it uh, spins. And whenever the fish bites down on it, it'll expose that hook right there. And then I have two different sizes of these. Another redfish. Mainly what I have in here is redfish and tarpon lures. And I also have these redfish magics. You can get them. You can get them up there at Walmart. And then I have a DOA shrimp. Um, I have the, this is the three-inch glow one. Um, I have a gotcha lure. You can see how much I use it. There's all that line in there. I got me a gotcha lure. It works great. Um, I have my bobbers, you know, just out there for to keep the weight above the water. And then, right here, I have a donk donk This is a summer top water plug. All you do is you just switch it and it, it'll walk around in the water and look like it's injured or redfish tarp. Um, for winter time, or for any time actually, you want redheads, jig heads, like this. It's not really, it's not a jig head, but red and clear or white, and it's a really great uh, lure. Like for these, I have this, and um, I have some white redfish magic bodies here. For the redfish magic soft baits, and you want red jig heads, then you uh, you can put it on a spinner. You don't have to; they work just as fine. It's just that um, with the spinner, you don't have to switch it. Um, I made this one. This, I made this saltwater uh, little lure here. It's actually really cool. Made it out of a sunkiss can. I have some 
uh, weights inside there. I need to put some more in it because most of them fell out. I have a split shut now. I have a hook on the back. I have a little silver right here. Um, if you're out there and you have nothing to use, you ran out of uh, single hooks like this right here, um, and you have treble hooks, but and you have some wire and you have nothing else, and a cam, uh, make it. Um, I'm not the one that made it. My dad made it. I don't know how he did it, but um, that's what he did, and he said it worked. But, um, stay tuned for some more of my episodes and subscribe. Thank you.